Hey everyone, I'm here to talk to you today about a really cool feature that just came out in Power BI. So those of you familiar with hierarchy buttons and the way to drill in and drill through using the hierarchy functions in Power BI visuals, well they've decided to completely update them and kind of redesign and improve the, the functionality and the layout and the look and feel of the buttons in Power BI Desktop. So what I want to do is hop in briefly into uh, Power BI Report and kind of just show you what those changes look like. So we have in front of us a Power BI desktop file that I've created, kind of as a template. And more specifically, I want to show you the hierarchies that we've had, just as a reminder of where they are. Now the goal of this video is not to be to walk through them, because that's already something that most of us know how to use. I just want to talk about the and explain how these buttons have changed in an update with Power BI. Traditionally, what we've had is a header row, something that's been up at the top of any visualization, with the ability to drill up, to drill down, and expand and collapse the hierarchies as necessary. Most of the controls have been found over on the left, as we see here, with the option on the right for that drill down function that lets you go into, say, camcorders, and then from, uh, from that product category, I can go into, say, digital cameras as a subcategory. Things like that. Uh, typical traditional functionality. Now, if we actually come up here, as part of the July release, and we go to File, and these are with any existing reports that you have, go to Options, and you come down here to Report Settings. So there's going to be an option in here called Hide the Visual Header Row, which turns the header off, but separately, the one that I specifically want to mention that's related to the hierarchy changes is using the modern visual header with updated styling options. So I'm going to click that. I'm going to select OK. Now watch what happens to the report when this changes. It's done something pretty drastic and kind of cool. It actually takes that separate header row we see at the top and it has combined it with the title. And even further, if we look over on the right of the title itself, the buttons are now located over there instead of a mixture of the left and the right, so they've combined them together. Now the actual icons themselves are still the same. The, the icons have not changed, however the location of one of the icons has now been updated. That drill down icon that used to be on the left is now located right here, one over from the drill up function. So we have drill down to get into those specific sections. And then those same navigation tools that we had before for navigating to the next level or to expanding down the next level are located on the far right. So essentially the same functionality. I think it's a bit better designed. The drill down was moved around, so it's a, it takes a second or two to get used to it, and you might click the wrong button once or twice. But overall, I think it's a drastic improvement. And the best part is, for the first time ever in Power BI, you can now move a visual up to the top border. You don't have to have that annoying gap that was required before because there was no physical way to ever move it past that invisible line for the header. So I hope this was useful to you. I find this a, a really nice improvement. And um, for any existing report, you do have to turn it on manually in that option setting like I mentioned. Um, otherwise, new reports, I believe, will eventually just start to, to have those turned on automatically. All right, with that being said, I will see you in our next video. If you found this useful, please make sure to like or subscribe to our YouTube channel, and I will see you next time.